What's up everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I wanted to do something a little bit different and because of that I decided that I would do a video where I tell you what my 10 favorite shorts from this season are. So without further ado let's just get into it. Uh, to start off, in 10th place, uh, there is Orange Colored Sky by Evgenia Medvedeva. I really love this program, I think it suits her and her style so, so well. Uh, the choreograph just did an amazing job here, she really sells this program. And I am sad that we didn't get to see enough of it, but of course I get that because of the transition and all the things she's been through, through uh, she didn't feel the program too much. But nevertheless, it was an amazing program and uh, I will really miss it. Then, uh, coming into ninth place, there is uh, Papadakis is Ron, a short program from this season. At the beginning, I didn't like it too much because I thought it was boring a little bit. But the more I watch it, the more I understand uh, the story behind it. And uh, I, it's a really beautiful program and I absolutely adore it. And I think it is the best program they have done yet. In eighth place, we've got Solim's short. Um, I think it's called Somewhere in Time. I just love Unsa skating so much. She is just so smooth. She literally flies across the ice. And her short program is really beautiful. She's so elegant and the music just suits her so well. And I just love the program. I think uh, the choreographing aspect of it. It is amazing and she really does know how to skate to this music and yeah, I mean, I absolutely adore it so much. Then uh, coming in seventh place, we have got Satoko Miyahara's short to a song for a little sparrow. I absolutely love Satoko skating because she is so musical and elegant and I mean, she is, I think, the most artistic skater among the current ladies and the program just suits her so well. I mean, I really, really, really love it. The music is amazing and uh, the music put together with Satoko skating just creates a literal masterpiece and I, I could watch Satoko skate for it. <laughs> like a day without getting bored because uh, she just is an amazing skater. Then in sixth place we have got Love is a Bitch by Jason Brown. I just, this program is just one of the best shorts of all time, I think. It, he just sells it so well, the music, the choreograph. The choreographing aspects, they are all so good. I mean, Jason is such an interpreter and she really does an amazing job at skating to this music and the sauce, uh, the, the whole, the overall feeling you get from the program, it is just unmatchable and I am so proud for him for skating it well at both words, nationals and internal center de France. I mean, I absolutely adore that program. Then in fifth place comes his teammate Joon Cha with his Cinderella program. I I think that his short program is actually underrated because of course everyone is going nuts about his free skate, which I do understand, but we really need to remember that his short program is just as good. I mean, the music, Cats are so interesting and so nicely put together and just, just flies across the ice. I mean, I just really love this program, the music and how June manages to skate to it. And I really hope that we will get to see something like this next season from him as, again, because he this program just suited him so well. Then... In fourth place, of course, I had to put Yuzuru in this um, list, otherwise it wouldn't have been <laughs> a fair list. So in fourth place, we've got Otonal from Yuzuru Hanyu. The program is just a masterpiece. Uh, the overall feeling you get from it is just amazing. Uh, Yuzuru, of course, is probably the best skater among all disciplines that we have currently. And uh, he is just such an amazing skater to watch and uh, he sells this program the step sequences to die for 
everything he does is just like really intense so of course you cannot not love his programs and then in third place is from my first moment by Kaori Sakamoto I have really fallen in love with her show program Kaori is such an energetic skater yet elegant and uh, what she does on the ice is just magical and the show program really reflects that it just it is such a nice show program and uh, her her skating matches the music and the overall style so so well and she could skate to this through program for the rest of her competitive seasons and I would be totally fine with it because it is just so amazing. Then in second place we have Tosca by Evgenia Medvedeva again. Uh, I wasn't really sure I would like the short program because of course uh, she changed uh, her short program before Russian Nationals and since I was so into orange colored sky I was kind of sad that she had decided to leave it but the more what well, just not the more as soon as I watched Asuka I totally fell in love with it it is just Evgenia is such a dramatic skater and she really brings her emotion to the ice and the music Tosca really reflects that. I mean, she, she just does an amazing job at skating to that kind of music and uh, her style really shines when she does this kind of program so it is absolutely a joy to watch and uh, like also the music cuts, everything about this program is just perfect and I am happy that she managed to skate it a clean at least uh, twice this season so that we I get to see it a lot because if we were left only with the one from Russian Nationals I wouldn't have really been able to enjoy the program for what it actually is. Then in first place Kind of unexpected, I think, but I have to put Sui Han's short to. Uh, I don't remember the music. Wait, let me check. To No One Like You by Red Electric. I am just so in love with the program. I mean, uh, in the first half of the season, we didn't get to see them at all, and so I wasn't. Re I kind of even forgot about them. And then Four Continents came and uh, I knew they were competing, but I also checked the results and I saw that they didn't do their exact best. And so in order not to put me off their programs, I decided not to watch them and then words came and uh, apparently they did an amazing short program. And so of course I had to go and watch it and uh, my god, I'm so glad I did because literally there is no... There is not a day that goes by without me watching their short program because it's just so good. It is just really the best short program of the season for me. They just, as Wenjing said, it is just their style. You can really see their personalities come through through the program and you just get involved in it at some point. And they are just amazing dancers, uh, amazing interpreters, and you, you just cannot not love their style because it is just so versatile and so nice and yes I just love them so so much and yes that is it for the video a pretty brief one I know but honestly it is the style I prefer and the style I am gonna stick with for the moment I hope you enjoyed the video let me know what your favorite shorts from this season are and I'll see you in the next video bye